Princess, we... A letter? Oh, I see. Oh, don't mind me. I was just speculating. Can we actually read this thing? Hmm. Yes, the script is inimitable by the honored guests. You must both be wary from your long journey. Please allow the fi- Please rest assured that the matter written about has been duly received. We just need some time to prepare. Please take a seat here in Leo Lee Pavilion, where you may enjoy some light refreshments while taking in the ocean view. Considered a small token of our esteem. Yay! Tasty snacks! They're giving us the VIP treatment! Of course. We treat visitors with the utmost respect here at the Feiyun Commerce Guild. When honored guests grace us with their presence, far be it from us to shirk our duty to them. Please, this way. And Paimon thought we'd get kicked out, or turned away at the door. Paimon didn't think Guhua Geek had so much clout. Thank you for your patience. With the amount of wealth and power Gentry Mount Sai has, it will take more than a slap on the wrist to get through to him. For him to correct the error of his ways, he must feel for himself the same suffering he has inflicted on Chang the Ninth. Since Gentry Mount Sai's business has to do with Core Lapis, we simply need to buy up all the stock there is in Liu. That will put him in a rather sticky situation. Deprived of the necessary raw materials, even the best craftsperson in Tevat would be unable to make their product. Great idea! That'll be sure to mess things up between him and the Fatui. But Liu is huge. Is it really possible to buy up every last bit of core lapis in the harbor? With the time scale we are on, it is indeed a challenge. Hence, as stated in the letter, we must ask for your further cooperation in the matter. First, there are a number of vendors in the city you will need to buy from. I've marked their respective locations on your map. There is also some unsold core lapis at the chasm. You will need to purchase that too. Finally, there is Chang the Ninth's batch. Alrighty, so three sellers in the city, another one at the chasm, and then Chang the Ninth. Roger that! Of course. We are not expecting you to cover the costs. Wow! So many Mora! With cash like this, Paimon could rent out Leoli Pavilion and eat there for a whole month! <laughs> well, this is not the first time we've had to do something like this. It's just par for the course now. All you need to do is strike a deal. The Feiyun Commerce Guild will handle the transportation and other trifling matters. Once you have purchased all the core lapis, please proceed to the Feiyun Commerce Guild's warehouse where you can see the rest of the plan unfold. Gotta hand it to Guhua Geek. This is some seriously solid work for a guy who lives in a fantasy world. Let's do this in the order the guy said. First the si You want... Well, that's sad. None... Oh, it's for the Feiyun Commerce Guild? Hmm, seems business trends are about to change in Liyue. Oh, uh... <laughs> nothing. Just talking to myself. Don't worry about my prior client. He hadn't made any down payments or anything. Quite common in the industry. Thank you for your patronage. We hope the Feiyun Commerce Guild will continue to do business... Huh. Huh. 
good day, my friend. Oh, I thought you were here to purchase... No, that I still have. Too much hassle, not enough return. What? <laughs> All right, I'll do it. Clearly no short... Oi! Shh! All of it? All of it would be far more than you actually... Fa if it's for the... Aha! Finally! As it happens, I do have a batch of Core Lapis that hasn't been shipped yet. The original buyer's price- Are you serious? We- I'm afraid it has to go to the highest bidder. I'm breaching an existing- uh, Look, you have your- All right, all right. When we get back, we'll just have- Wait! <laughs> Surely there's- Please, don't do this. It might be the guild's money. If he asks, all we can do- I- I understand. There's just one other thing, though. I don't know where exactly, but if I can't re So... maybe you could go and look for the carts? There should be f Oh, thank you very much. That's that, then. Well... Don't get 
Frostbite. Freeze.
so that should be all of them. Let's get back. <sighs> this has all been quite exhausting for poor little Paimon. He definitely owes Paimon some snacks. Wonderful. Thank you. Done and dusted. Yeah! Paimon's got a knack for this business malarkey. Now for the final stop on our Corlapis Crawl. To Chang the Ninth's place. Just who I was hoping to see. I was just thinking to myself, Gentry mount sized thugs have been mysteriously absent for a while now. You wouldn't know anything about that, would you? Oh, don't worry. You won't be hearing from them again. Oh? What, what happened? I see now. You're, you're in this trade, too. So you're trying to beat him to the post, eh? Appearances can be deceiving, that's for sure. But I don't care who you are. A discount of 70% is simply impossible. The, the maximum I can do is 40% off, and even then I'm, I'm only breaking even. Great. You mean you're not trying to force the price down? What, what, what's going on? If I died and gone to I can't believe it. I will make a profit on this batch after all. But gentry mount size. If Paimon told you they're not going to bother you again, then you'd better believe they're not going to bother you again. Huh. Okay, then. My situation can hardly get worse from here in any case. But tell me, what on earth do you plan to do with so much core lapis? Actually, it's for a commission. Can't go into too much detail. Thank you. Thank you a million times over. I really don't know what to say. Good people always get what's coming to them in the end. 
and so will the nasty people. Anyway, let's get going, because apparently we have a show to watch at the Feiyun Commerce Guild's warehouse. Welcome. The final act in this drama would not be complete without you two here as audience. You better believe it! We're the ones who've been doing all the work! Uh, well, Divine Halberd and Ominous Sword, Mir and the way the story develops across the first five volumes. Nothing short of exemplary. But the sixth volume? Oh, words fail me. How blessed we are to have such an author grace our world with such works. And this is related to Gentry Meltsai, how? It's not, but when something surpasses expectations to such a degree, one must show one's appreciation. And it is thanks to your help that everything will play out just as I had foreseen. Why does Paimon have to be the only one who doesn't get what's going on? No fair! Uh, so go on then, tell me, what are we doing here? And what's this big dramatic show- Think about it. He panics, 
Without the goods, he can't fulfill his contract. He hears a rumor that the Feyun Commerce Guild is the culprit. Panic turns to disbelief. Jinshi Maotsai is a hugely powerful figure in the business world. Never has anyone dared to target him like this. So regardless of whether it is revenge or a swift resolution that he seeks... So it was you! You were the one sticking your necks out for Chang the Ninth! Speak of the devil. I went ev- Core Lapis is hardly a rare mineral. We are not persecuting- Was it not one of your own men who said, this isn't over? <clears throat> you clear- Master, if you please. Seize their co- Impressive. You are no commoners. <laughs> Their strength is almost spent. Might I remind you that the Fatui's relationship... W w what are you saying? Master... Eh then figure it out by... D don't go. Wh My lord, what are you doing here? Are you hurt? Thanks to this valiant young... My lord? You... You... Indeed, my liege. Drats! I've been played like a fiddle. Gentry Mautzai. Coercion and intim... I shudder to think with the Fatu... You meddling swine! Well, go on. Since you asked Chang the Ninth for a discount of 70%, let's fight three times the market rate sounds fair, no? How dare you subject me to such... Deep breaths now. This is a simple... I, I, I... On behalf of the Feiyun Commerce Guild, I thank you for your business, and hope you will continue to do business with us in future. You? Funny-speaking, book-reading, guhua geeking tsing Cho are the heir of the Feiyun Commerce Guild? So that massive stash of Mora you let us burn through in a day? That was from your private vault? Twas but a paltry sum. I got to make a very sound investment while putting Gentry Maltzai in his place. A classic two birds, one stone situation. You're too kind. You have valor in your heart. And that is worthy of admiration. Yikes! Paimon's been calling you Guhua Geek this whole time! Paimon read in one of these martial artist novels that when rich heirs like you get angry at someone, you have their arms and legs chopped off! Ha! Paimon's toast! And sorry! Very sorry! Please don't hurt Paimon! 
Calm down. Since you can fly, you hardly... Ah! Save me! Save me! This is not a drill! Repeat! This is not a drill! Jokes aside, I have the two of you to thank for this successful resolution. Really, you were a huge help. Meanwhile, Legend of the Shattered Halberd was positively riveting. Much obliged if you could return it to Chang the Ninth for me. I did nothing, and hence deserve none of his gratitude. The two of you, meanwhile, to have made such valiant and chivalrous- My lord, uh, forgive the intrusion. It's about your father. Please inform my father, thusly. I have averted a disaster and earned a sizable sum of money in the process. Might this meritorious act compensate for my prior transgressions and earn me a few more days of freedom, perchance? Legend of the Shattered Halberd speaks of a domain that I should very much like to investigate. For all your clever long words, the fact is you're just a lazy bones who doesn't want to work. <laughs> what if I told you that a reward awaits you at Cheng the Ninth's palace, and not just his gratitude? A reward? Hmm. Well, that sweetens the deal somewhat. Ah. <sighs> It seems whatever I say, there's no pers- Oh, I didn't realize- Thank you in advance for returning the book for me. I will take my leave now. May we meet again, fellow merchants. Finally, you're back! This morning, the pawnbroker showed up and gave me back my entire collection. I'm positive that you must have been behind this once again. Thank you. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. Please don't say that. You have... The Chang family was a prestigious household in Liyue back in the day. Unfortunately, after I took over the family's affairs as heir, a series of business setbacks devoured our fortune. Since then, I've saved for years, hoping to restore the house to its former glory. 
In the end, everything was riding on this core lapis deal. Were it not for you, this barren wasteland in the mountains would have become my final resting place. Wow, that's the second heir we've met in this town. I'm sorry, what? Uh, nothing? Oh, here's your book back. Wonderful. Legend of the Shattered Halpert. I was beginning to think that Goofwa rascal had swindled me. Do people really look down on the Goofwa clan so much? Actually, the art is centuries old and was once held in high esteem. But now it... To instigate a revival, you need to inject some fresh blood, but it's hard to attract budding young talent. In any case, Guhua kids these days. Take that young rascal Xingqiao, for instance. For all his talk about repaying kindness with... Ah, uh, what does it matter? Anyway, you wanted the Liyue volume of the... T it's yours to keep. In addition, here is but a small token of appreciation for your huge generosity. My ore is sold, and my treasured books have returned. I can't believe it. Uh, what? What was that? Paimon saw something fall out. Oh, nothing, nothing. That little rascal, surely... Wow, she sure didn't waste any time. So, how'd it go? Did you... So there's two? So where's the other gem now? Another gem? Sounds like we need to investigate the site of the robbery. But uh, what about the preparations for the sub... Hey, we're in this together. 
together. There's no way we're backing out now.
Want a taste of my hammer? Windblade! Ha! Ah, your verdict is? Suppose this will do. in the middle of nowhere. Guardian? Calm down. I think we're safe. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Don't mind him. <sighs> the robbery took everything from us. We can't just let that slide, so I'm taking my men to confront them and get back some of what they stole at least. Hazardous materials. Uh, for the love of... You can't just... But that's what the crates had written on them. They're fireworks. What a... Ugh. Just ignore him, please. As you can see, some of my guys aren't particularly bright. If the guards at Caravan Rebot hear of this, we'll get questioned all over again.
to some tribal camps in the desert. Everybody's looking to celebrate with the Sub-Zero's festival coming up. Even small businesses like us got a share of the orders. Mostly the long distance transports that no one else wanted. Well, it was like this. We had just set out on the remote path when... A web of thorns and vines suddenly blocked our way! Vines? What? No! Why would there be vines in the desert? Our wagon got stuck in the sand. That's what happened. I'm sure it wasn't after that. Bombs started falling from the sky. Bombs? Oh, just stop talking. <laughs> Don't listen to his nonsense. He's just a bit shaken up by what happened. Anyway, as we were trapped, the bandits started firing rockets at us, which made a lot of the fireworks go off. And the uh, no, we couldn't really see anything. There was sand everywhere, and we were more preoccupied with getting out alive. Although, I did notice that one of the bandits had this green stone. Yes, exactly like that. I just couldn't make sense of it. I, I, if you already have something that valuable, why go after our cheap firecrackers? Well, all right. We'll just take another quick... So, one group of bad guys attacked the other? hopes the Sub-Zero's festival doesn't get ruined. Oh? And what things would those be? Sounds like something the General Mahamatra should know about. Sino, what are you doing here? I'm here on business, investigating an unusual robbery case. Wait, could it be the same one we've been investigating? Just doing my duty. By the way, I brought some... Um, okay, thanks. Well, find any clues? They say the proof is in the... <coughs> Did you have to... 
Anyway, back to the matter at hand. Tell me more about... Hmm, I see. Yep, Candace can tell you- All right, you can leave the rest to me. On a different note, do you have any other plans for the day? Oh, we'll probably head back with Candace. So... so... Hmm, strange. Sounds... Uh, what? <laughs> hmm... Do you know why Hannah? Um... Because... They're always going to be... Get it? Like the... Oh, we get it! S seriously? Is that so? Y what? Because... They always wind up... Yeah, who knew being interrogated by the general... Candace! Thank goodness you're back. Please save us. Nice to see you, Candace. The Traveler already updated me on everything. But, when I asked about their plans this afternoon... C candace It's supposed to be a secret! What? Why didn't you say something soon? Well, once you told me about the case, I realized I might not make it this afternoon. Seriously? So we had to... Well, with that resolved... Oh, and these are the items I was supposed to get. Sure thing, we've got this. I would hope so. I just... Oh, enough already! Thank you. 